Ah. Open. Have you guys tried this? It's awesome. Trust me. It's like some kind of palm cheese of meat. Oh my god. I feel so gross right now. This is my skin. Really. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing well. It's been ages that we have met. So what's up? What's happening? What's the news and an all info? So I recently went to India, met my parents, had a great, great, great time. So this is a different setup today. I am in my bedroom and I thought maybe the lighting is best here. So honestly, today's video, I did not think or procrastinate or did anything uh, in my schedule. Like it's just like a random thing that I wanted to do, share it with you guys. So let's begin. I was uh, for the past, honestly, for the past couple of months, I was trying out a uh, sort of derma planning, if I might call it. Uh, so I was kind of shaving my face at home. I just wanted to experiment it because honestly, I was not sure because I was skeptical because I kept on thinking that, you know, what if I get bumps and rashes? So I was... Um, kind of a little hesitant when I started. Uh, I started uh, shaving my face uh, probably from uh, last year, November, if not mistaken, yes. And I thought finally I'm gonna share it with you guys and let you know how I shave my face and what I do and what exactly uh, are the steps that I take to maintain and to ensure that you know I don't uh, cut myself up unnecessarily or uh, you know any kind of or there's any kind of hassles uh, before we go ahead there are a few pointers that I would like to mention here number one I shaved my face just because I wanted a very smooth application of makeup let me know in the comment section below if you guys want to see pictures of uh, me wearing makeup without shaving and with shaving my face so it's a huge difference I have seen it tried tested and that is the main reason why I wanted to experiment with this so enough of a blabbering let's just get into the video I just wanted to scoot you guys in and wanted to show you exactly what I'm talking about because I have not shaved my face for more than one and a half months uh, it was high time for me to do it and I'll scoot you guys in so that you can see exactly what I'm talking about so as you can see this is my skin without shaving and yeah oh my god that is too close so yes girl your girl needs a lot of face shaving doesn't she so first thing that i like to do is i will definitely use a makeup remover makeup remover wipe and uh, makeup remover wipe and uh this is a regular one i got from target i guess uh, it is the best part was it had aloe vera so i was like yay give it to me give it to me okay i have a mirror here i will be looking um a lot here so yep So the razor that I have been using is the most trusted and the most talked about razor of all times, Tinkle Razors from Amazon. I'm gonna link uh, it in the description box below and I'm sure zillions of you are already aware of this by now. Thank you. 
pointing to the nose. Dust. Yeah, so this part of my face is now shaved and I will be moving on to the forehead which is technically the most trivial part because you have to be extra careful for your brows. Well, I'm not shaving my brows because no way I cannot take that risk because I still need to master this art of shaving and I guess it'll take some more time for me to master that art. And so I'm just avoiding brows. That's why I have uh, filled in my brows and shaped it just to ensure that I do not even barge nearby or go nearby that area. It feels honestly so satisfying that like so much of dead skin and dead cells are going out. Trust me, it's like so satisfactory. Yes, so that's it. I'm done with shaving my face. The next thing that I do is take another uh, wet wipe and wipe it off uh, thoroughly just to ensure that everything is smooth and nice. proper care um, after shaving your face is like a must 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 thing as I was telling you guys you should and must 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 take care of your skin um, especially immediately after shaving and what I have uh, of late what I have started doing is I am using this uh, bamboo gel I am not sure if you guys are aware of the benefits of bamboo gel oh my god let me tell you guys uh, bamboo gel is like the thing I'm like obsessed with bamboo gel I apply it in my hair on my face mask oh, like after shaving my face everywhere it soothes the skin it is very 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 good for dry and sensitive skin which is what I have Of course use a regular moisturizer or anything that uh, you feel is good for your skin or else you can also use aloe vera gel like if you have an aloe vera plant at home just like scrape it out and use the gel so so whatever is convenient for you you can use it if you guys can then do get your hands on it I am going to link this in the bottom bar so you can have a look I'm just gonna let this be for a couple of minutes before washing it off with normal water I try to use cold water while washing it off and you guys also should keep that in mind use cold water because it'll close the pores now and let your skin rest because that is exactly what you need right now so yeah 